Hey everyone, it's Martin MI5 here today. Today I wanted to make a video saying, we were talking about how to day trade with just $100. Can it be done? Answer is yes. Will you make a lot of money right away doing that? No. But with day trading, there really is no minimum that you need to start. I mean, with these brokerages today like Robinhood, SoFi app, Weeble app, things like that, you can start well 50 bucks 100 bucks whatever you want now you're going to make that put that first hundred dollars in there you're going to turn that to 200 300 400 500 and then so on build up your account build up your capital because the more you trade the more money you're going to be able to make definitely with this game the more more money makes more money that's the way it works now, I went from grocery store clerk, deli clerk, you know, slicing people's deli meat, frying their chicken form, to eventually making 50K a month with day trading. Now, if I can do it, you guys can definitely do it too. And um, I'm going to get ready to take you to my computer screen. I'm going to show you kind of how I start it and how I got to that point. And then um, we'll come back and talk about it. Here we go. As promised, we're here on my computer screen and I wanted to show you guys what is possible, how much you guys can make and what I have made. So this is a screenshot directly from my Robinhood account. This was back in June 3rd, 2021. The stock was AMC. And this is when we're having a nice good AMC push. And I made a lot of money on a swing trade. Now a day trade is when you buy a stock and sell a stock within the same trading day. A swing trade is when you hold it longer than a day. This is two days. And you guys can see I had a thousand shares of AMC at an average cost of $30.89 each. And total return on just, like I said, just two days. That was $40,530. 131.21% return. Now just let that sink in just a little bit. That right there, just in that one day, was twice what I was making per year in my grocery store deli clerk job working at this, you know, a store. So that was like mind blowing. And you know what? To be honest with you, yes, I did start lower than this, obviously, but I'm showing you this is one of my be best trades. It didn't take me that long to get to this point. Really, in my case, only a few months. So that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. If you guys are thinking about getting into trading, specifically day trading and swing trading stocks, I highly recommend it. And don't put doubt in yourself thinking you can't do it because I didn't think I could either. And lo and behold, I did. So, this is like the peak. This is what you're really aiming for here is the, the big time, right? But let's get back down to normal levels when you're starting off first, okay? I just wanted to show you guys. And if you guys want to see more of these trades, they're all on my older videos where I showed step-by-step -step all the different trades I made with Neo Stock, Lucid, and some other ones, and including this one here. So, let's get back to normal levels trading with a hundred dollars here we go now I'm on my actual live Robin Hood account uh, on this account right now I only have a few stocks that I'm holding on here I don't have a lot on there um, you can see my the buying power I have on this one is just a little bit it's twenty seven hundred dollars basically we're not gonna use all that though I want to show you guys what you can do with a hundred dollars because that's what the video is about so, I kind of already spoiled it a little bit there, but we have what they call a buy order and we're going to buy in shares. So, this particular stock example is called NEO, it's 524. It's an affordable stock that you guys can be able to buy because it's not very expensive per share. So, we're going to buy 18 shares and that'll be 9432. Actually, let's see. Yeah, we can actually buy 99 or we can buy 19 and it'll still be 
just a hair under a hundred bucks. You can see right here estimated cost ninety nine fifty six if we buy it at its actual current price. Okay, so we would buy that, and then you would own nineteen shares of this product. Okay, so we're going to use two dollars as an example. Say Neo went up instead of five twenty four. Say it went to seven twenty four. That would be you would make two dollars off of each share that you own. So we'll get a little calculator out here, and we have nineteen shares, and we're going to make two dollar profit off of each one. Two. So with that, you would be able to make thirty eight bucks off of that price fluctuation. Like I said, not a lot at the beginning, but that's how I started. You get to just keep building and building and building up. So then you would have that plus your 99.56. 99.56. So now instead of <coughs> $100, your new capital that you can trade with is 137.56 okay so you see where I'm going with this now we're gonna see how many shares we can buy with that amount of money what did I just say we had so there you go <coughs> excuse me so now, instead of the 19 shares that we bought earlier, now you could afford to buy 26 shares. Okay. So let's just use that same math. Let's say we made two dollars off of each share. So that'd be 26 times two. So that'd be. Fifty-two dollars that you'd make, plus the one hundred and thirty-seven that you already had. I think it was one thirty-seven fifty-six, but we'll just use this for example. So now you have a hundred and eighty-nine dollars. Okay, so the money's starting to add up now. Now this is not going to happen overnight. It's going to take time if you're if you're only starting with a hundred, but you can. So let's see how many shares we can get with one hundred eighty-nine dollars. Uh, it looks like 36 going to be the most that we can get. So, 36 shares. So we have 36 available. And let's just say we made $2 off of each one. So then you're making $72 plus your, I think it was 187 I just said. I think I messed up in the calculation slightly there, but you guys get the idea. Now you're working at around two, you know, a little over 250 bucks, and you're just going to keep doing that over and over. Somebody described it as like going to the gym. It's it's very very similar to that. If you want to gain muscle, you got to go on a regular basis. You got to show up. You got to work out. In the first day or two, you're not going to notice anything. Uh, probably not even in the first month or two it's very 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 incremental but some of these real large bodybuilders have been doing this for five ten years or whatever it may be and they're freaking massive they probably if they would have quit when they didn't see any immediate results they never would have got to be where they are now and, and that's how i built up to to what i just showed you guys earlier with that amc trade like 40 40 k um earnings there so you guys can always start with more to begin with obviously I'm showing you in this video example with a hundred dollars you can start with 200 500 something like that actually that's what I would really recommend if you could and I'm gonna show you guys how to make that money if you're not making enough money at your job to be able to put in money for trading I'll show you on some of my other videos what you can do to, to get that so I think I'm gonna wrap this video up 
I pretty much summed up what I needed to do in this video. There's a lot more things you guys are going to have questions about how often you can tr day trade on an account like this. Um, it, it's, it's a long story. i got to get deeper into that. I'll explain that on future videos. If you guys want to see future videos of this, I'm planning on doing them. But let me know. I'm not, I don't want to waste my time making them if you guys don't want to watch them. So make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. And click that notification bell so you'll be notified of my daily uploads, including this one. If you guys want to see more of this, I definitely will be showing it. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon.